What's going on? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be going over the Adventure Quest news. We do this every Thursday. Welcome back. Okay, well, let's get straight into it. So, uh, a few in-game things to go over. The, just things I want to do in case some people are forgetting about these things. So, here's a little checklist of things to do. Um, if you have a lot of spare time or you just want to make sure you get all the items that are going to go rare as possible. So, uh, if you go to shops and you have a membership in Adventure Quest Worlds, there's a new testing class right now, the Glacial Berserker Test. Uh, the skill, these skills might change, and this class is not the real class. It will actually turn into warrior class, but it'll keep the name, or you can keep it and merge it into a armor. So get this, because it'll be a super rare item. Uh, so definitely get that if you have a membership. So after you're done doing that, if you're a non-member, uh, you can come here, talk to Tinsel, and do all these quests. So. These quests give you gift box swords and stuff, and they don't look that cool. They're in my inventory right now. They're AC items. So you can store them in your bank for free if you don't have a lot of inventory space. So get all these items, put them in your bank if you don't have enough inventory space or something. Because these will turn into cooler items, like much better rare items. So get these. I know last year I didn't know that for some reason. I don't know why I didn't know that. I guess I just like didn't pay attention, didn't read the quest. And I didn't get the items last year. They were like steampunk cool items. Yeah, like, uh, like, uh, it kind of, like, they have the Santa hat, but, like, a steampunk version of it, and stuff like that in, uh, the gift boxes. So, definitely get these items if you're a non-member. Okay, so we have a confirmation on how to get the class, the new class, for non-members. Uh, so, this guy asks, uh, do you still need rank 10, um, Glacira, Glacira? I don't know. Uh, not for the member-only test, because that's just gold in a member. But once the class goes live, you will. So that confirms it. You will need rank 10 in the new rep. So here's some more information about the new rep. Uh, if you want to farm it, the best way to farm it will be tomorrow. Tomorrow, a 72 hour uh, boost is going to start. Uh, it'll boost everything, it'll double everything. And if you have a boost on top of your boost, it. So, all right, so I'll explain it very quickly. So if you get 200 rep per quest turn in, uh, the boost will make that 400 and if you have a boost activated on your account, it'll make it 800 So you're doubling the doubled which is crazy So definitely want to take advantage of the two times boost that will be active tomorrow along with a 72 hour rare drop We don't know what this drop could be. I speculate that it's the ugly Christmas sweater that they made um, I have a picture of it somewhere. Let me find it Alright, here is the picture. So they made this. It was in the game. It was on Reen's character page and uh, there was a male and a female version of it. Uh, but it was never actually added to the game. Pe uh, I think they said that they were going to release it for hero points, but they didn't. Uh, so this could be the 72 hour rare drop, but that is of course 100% just speculation. Uh, tomorrow is also the part 2 of the war. Uh, it's a three-part war. The finale will be on the 30th, but tomorrow is part two and the limited quantity sets. So, uh, the shop is actually live. I'll leave a link to the limited quantity shop in the description of this video so you can go there, bookmark it, so you're ready to go as soon as the shop is live. Um, here's basically the, the most of the sets. Uh, they're adding a new blue version, so take a good look at that, the new weapon and that stuff. And if we go here, you can see the blue version will be in this shop right here. Uh, it's not on the uh, picture, but when you buy this, there's only 900 left and it's 2k AC. But if you buy this, you get the red versions of the armor and also the new blue version that they're adding to the shop. Also, uh, there is a new Mulligan house, which I will show you in game right now. So we're going to go slash house. I've already showed this in a previous uh, news video, but I figured I'd show it again. It's a very small house. And some people might not have uh, seen it. So here it is. It's basically just that you're going through. There's the brain, uh, the heart, the intestines. And then you're going out uh, that area of the mall. <laughs> so it, it's a pretty cool house. Is it worth two? Wait, what's the price on it? Is it worth 1,500 adventure coins? 
uh, which is roughly like fifteen dollars, ten fit. Yeah, it's like fifteen dollars. Um, it's up to you really if you like the house or not. I don't think I'll be buying it, but I really do think it's a cute house and it's a pretty cool idea for a house. And it will be rare because it is in the limited quantity shop. So once all those two thousand quantity is gone, it'll be gone forever. So if you like that house, that's a pretty cool thing. It's in game right now, so you can go look at it if you want to go to Slash House Reigns. Also, uh, there's two different uh, sets for gold. You have both the uh, Frostling Whore and the Battle Lord of Ravens. So there's the AC version, which I don't recommend anyone buy. Uh, the member version. Well, if you really like it and you only have ACs, but I still think that thousand is a little bit too, a little bit too many. I mean, it's only $5 for the set, so if you really like it, it's a, it's a pretty good deal for a whole set, but I don't know. I, I would go with the gold version, because uh, I think the, yeah, and if you've ever bought a membership previously, like, say you have an account right now, but your account's not a member, but say, like, in the past, you bought a three-month membership or something, you can still buy this set. Just a little pro tip for you, because it says Legends only. Uh, which legends are anyone that's ever got a membership on their account and members are people that have active memberships on their accounts So this is for legends, which means anyone that eat has a previous membership can also buy it and the items will be non-member uh, Well, that's speculation of course because that's how all of the previous ones have been and uh, These little helmets are very cool, too. It's kind of hard to see. Maybe I can zoom in here Enhance. All right, so there's two really cool hair helmets. Actually, we have an in-game, uh, in-game screenshot of one. There we go. Not well, not screenshot, but so it's kind of like a Christmas tree with the lights and the star at the top, and the cool ass hair. I like that hairstyle a lot. Uh, very cool. So Z coming at us with new Phoenix blades. These look insane. I really hope these are something you can get. Uh, and there aren't locked behind a certain amount of years of playtime. Moving on. <laughs> so the Paragon Pain Deer Rider Bank Pet came out last week. And tomorrow, the Legion Token version of the Pain Deer will come out with Legion Token Quest. Confirmed on the design notes. So, 100% confirmed. It's coming out tomorrow. Alright, so if you have an account in Adventure Quest Worlds and you haven't been banned or your account hasn't been muted for a certain amount of time like I think if you got like one two maybe even three mutes you're fine but if you got muted for like more than 24 hours or there's a certain amount of time that you can't be muted for uh, so if you weren't muted a lot and you didn't get banned in 2017 you'll be getting 500 ACs on Jan early January I think it's January 1st but I could be wrong probably depends on when they're doing an update in January when you'll get those ACs probably the first update of January will be when you get those so keep that in mind um, you can save those buy maybe some of the pink the new pink helmets that are in the game from last week those are very cool they're in the I think they're in featured items yeah like you can get these they're only a few ACs really cool they would be really cool rares when they're gone and also uh, this I don't think they're actually doing this as like a Christmas thing. Well, I know they're not because they messed up. Uh, so there was a little, the, they were doing some programming or something and they kind of deleted everyone's uh, green elf set that you need to craft in AQ3D. Uh, so because of that, they gave everyone 250 uh, dragon crystals in AQ3D. Uh, that's for all players. So even if you haven't logged in since the Frost update, you'll still get it. Uh, so yeah, you can spend those 250 dragon crystals on the on anything you want from Frostfowl, I guess, or just save them if you don't like any of the items, of course. Uh, so the apparently the set costs 200 to craft or 150 to craft, and they're giving you 200, so they're actually giving you 100 more than their mistake cost them. So very cool, it's kind of like a little Christmas gift for AQ3D. I thought I'd just throw that in here. All right, so thank you guys for watching this video. Pretty short news video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Um, tell me what you're most excited for. I'm really excited for the helmets that are coming with the new limited quantity shop. And when is the shop actually live? Does it say? Okay, so 6 p.m. Eastern, which is 3 o'clock where I live uh, on the West Coast. So 6 p.m. on the, the East Coast, so EST. 6 p.m. EST is when the shop is going live uh, tomorrow, Friday. 
So set your alarms, do something so you're ready to get into the shop. I honestly don't think any of the quantities are going to run out in the first wave. Like, eh, probably not. Like, we got 3k quantity, 20k quantity, 7k quantity, 3k quantity. Like, I don't think any of these are going to run out. Maybe this one, but I still doubt it because they actually had to add another set just so they could sell out of that one. These are definitely not selling out, <laughs> but you know, uh, still doesn't hurt to be there early. Like sometimes they'll set aside like a certain amount so they can only sell a certain amount at one time. So like at this 20k, they'll probably only be like 2,000 available at the 20k or something like that because they do restocks. So. That's the overall quantity, so they'll probably, you, they might run out of the first quantity on, uh, like, an item like this that's free for all players. Uh, but that's just for the first restock, and then you can wait for the next restock of that. Alright, leave a like if you enjoy, guys. Comment down below. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I wanted to uh, quickly just go over one little thing here. So, if you haven't checked out any of my previous videos, we go over a glacial rep in this video. We go over the glacial class and all the skills in that video. Uh, top three easy to get classes in Adventure Coast World. Just like uh, starting classes that are very easy to get, that don't take a lot of time to get, and that are good for new players or people who just want a better class. So we go over the top three of that in that list. And uh, yeah, a little live stream where we uh, goof around in AQW. So if you haven't seen any of those videos, I'd recommend them, you know, especially if you want to see the Glacial Berserker class and you don't have a membership to try it out. Uh, that video does a good job of showing off the new class and what it does. And I also use the new class in this live stream for the whole stream. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace. Hey, what's up guys? It's Garrus here.